What up? What up? How'd you characterize your round, Brooks? Pretty flat. Um, you know, being in contention the last two weeks, playing what maybe six weeks in a row. Um, a bit tired, to be honest with you. So definitely came out flat. But I mean, I got to play. I got no other option. Not gonna happen. Did, did you consider taking a week off after you know skipping this one to, to have a little rest? Not really, because I thought even if I gain one, you know, one spot in the FedEx, it makes it that much easier for next week. So. You know, you got to play, see where you're at. I mean, I don't think I've ever played more than four in a row, pretty much out here. Um, so, it'll be a, quite a long stretch, but I got to do what I got to do. How hard is it to play from the rough out here? I mean, saw a couple of shots guys hit. I mean, hard to move it forward. Is it as penal as it looks? Yeah, I think in the morning, especially when it's wet, it's very tough um, to advance it, and you. Can, you can get some sketchy lies out here. You can get some lies that sit on top, and then you can get someone that sit quite deep down, and it's tough to advance it. But put in the fairway, you got the ball in hand, so you're fine. Yeah. yeah. What was your takeaway from last weekend? I mean, obviously it didn't play out the way you wanted to. And as you've had time to reflect on it, how do you feel about it? And what did you learn from it? Um, kind of played similar to how I played today. I don't know. Um, you know, I struggled a little bit getting on my left side on Sunday, um, just didn't quite have it, you know, yeah. I feel like the first time I've had, haven't had it in a while, um, at a major, but, you know, I mean, you, even Beth Page, I thought I played pretty good, it just got very difficult at the end, yeah. um, hit some good shots, and, you know, it's up to the wind, whether it stays below the trees or above it there, um, but, I mean, it's going to happen eventually, I mean, I mean, sooner or later, I'm going to miss a cut eventually. So I wouldn't, uh, just is what it is. It's just the nature of the game was not physically related or was that part no, of it? No, it's all right. I mean, my body's nowhere near 100%, but yeah. at the same time, it'd be nice to have a couple of weeks off to kind of get ready for the U.S. Open. And given sort of the chatter that arose from Saturday night and some of the comments, what did you make of that? Did Was too much made of some of what you said or... Or just yeah, I think so. Um, yeah. Like I said, I apologize for the for the other guys' uh, comment just because I didn't, I really didn't look at the leaderboard. Um, yeah. I, I saw Dustin was at nine, I was at five at that point, and then made two coming in. So I really didn't even know where where I kind of stood. Um, didn't really look coming off eighteen, and then went right into the interview. So I, I didn't, I had no idea who was who was eight, who was seven. But I never really looked at guys that are tied with me. I was going to look ahead, so yeah. I had no idea. But. I get it. I get how it came across, and I apologize for that. One last thing. Do you sort of, you'd rather not be in the position you're in, but do you embrace a bit of the challenge of trying to, you know, here you are trying to improve it and get to where you want to be? I mean, yeah, I mean, I'd like to be in Atlanta. That's yeah. the whole goal. That's the whole reason we're playing. Um, you know, to see if you can better yourself or it makes next week a whole lot easier. You never want to be kind of on that bubble. Um, you know, behind the eight ball, usually we really don't start playing until March. And obviously right around the players and and then with the injury before so it's kind of like you know six months and not really playing so I've kind of had to make up for it but I, I've got no other option thank you yep have we made too much of your relationship with with Dustin yeah we worked out for I worked with Joey for two years um, yeah I mean I don't know it's I don't know what you guys you guys make your own stories so I have no idea what y'all do but yeah, I think I think even the Jordan and Justin thing gets blown out too much. I think you guys overplay. You guys overplay a lot of things. <laughs> All right, thanks, buddy. Yeah, thanks, Brooks.